Here's something I bet you didn't know existed, because honestly, I didn't know it existed either. There was a little bit of a hint leading up to this and that the package of the green far shot, yeah, those come in green now, by the way, showed a picture of this and that was it. We had no other idea at all this was even a thing. It was coming when it was coming, nothing. And yet, here it is. The Boomco Crank Force. I have left it in the box, I have opened the box, but I have not shot it or anything yet. Because there is now a small amount of hype leading into if this thing is actually good or not. It cost me $20 off Amazon, which was relatively cheap. And there's a lot here for 20 bucks. But there's a couple of things that make me interested in how this blaster actually works. Fires up to 70 feet, which is a good range claim. It's rapid fire with epic cranking action. And comes with an eight dark quick clip. So they obviously skipped out on the, the ammo there, but oh well. Crank Force. The Crank Force features epic cranking action and quick, quick capabilities. Crank once and pull the trigger for single fire or hold the trigger and keep cranking for an intense rapid fire blitz. Man, that better actually be an intense rapid fire blitz because that's what this thing is going to rely on on if it gets a recommendation or not. If this thing is actually as good as I think it might be, this will be a solid Boomco primary or maybe even a secondary because it doesn't look like it's that big. Single fire and rapid fire, blast more with dart storage. Not much point of having, well actually no. You got the clip right there, you got the dart storage right there. I can kind of see that working. Blast faster with crank action. And you can attach the crank handle to either side. And on the very back of the box, look for more Boomco. They advertise the slam bow, which is a turreted slam blast crossbow, which actually looks pretty good. And they advertise the 40 round clip. So, hey, that's all looking pretty good. What do you give in the box? Well, you get this. And honestly, it's a, it's a fairly decent sized blaster. It's a little bit bigger than the uh, brake flip or something like that, but not by a whole lot. So there's obviously going to be some, uh, some assembly here. We've even got a stock attachment right there, which is brand new to Boomco. And none of their blasters really come with stocks, but... Obviously, you're going to need something to brace yourself when you're cranking this thing. So, well, the hype is a little bit real. Let me put this thing together and we'll see how it fires. Well, here's a better idea of what comes in the box. You've got the blast yourself, which has a massive handle and feels absolutely perfect to me. Not bad at all. Even that little ridge right there you think might actually hurt and it doesn't. So that's, that's going pretty good for it. You've got the stock, which doesn't look to be removable. We'll clip that in. Let's see if we can remove it. Oh, holy crap. Uh. <laughs> holy crap. There we go. Yeah, that's not going to be removable. That took a hell of a lot of force to put on. And now you're looking pretty darn spiffy. And then, of course, your crank. Alrighty, we're all set to go. Now, the question is, how well does it shoot? The moment of truth. Clip feeds in vertically, just like the, what was that, the crank bow? Alrighty, I'm excited. Oh, the handle fell right off. Let's see if we can't get that in a little bit better. Okay, so huh. well, the single fire with this is very interesting, very, very interesting. But the rapid fire works great and the velocity seems rather promising. I shot it off into the bathroom and it flew straight and true and hit the wall, no problems whatsoever. So I am quite, quite smitten with this. I don't know how much I'd be using it for 
the single shot, because that's kind of how it works. You just crank it and then it goes flop and then you pull the trigger and of course it's got a lock on it, so I have to go get a clip in here. Come on. But that's a that's a reasonable rate of fire. That's a totally reasonable rate of fire. Got a big tactical rail up here, and of course, if you want, oh, snipe. <laughs> well, uh, apparently that's removable. <laughs> so, uh, there we go. Can I? Oh, that's not coming out without any kind of fight. So, obviously, I would put it like this because I'm going to be faster rotating with my main hand than my off hand. Hmm. So, the crank force came out of nowhere, and this is definitely a solid, solid Boomco primary. Definitely not secondary. It is rather huge. And for sling points, you've really got one up here somewhere in the stock and in the handle. Nothing that screams to me, sling me, which is a bit, bit underwhelming. But, so sling right there, sling right there, you should be fine. For, I, I'm going to ramble a little bit here, for $20, assuming that is the actual price of this blaster, pretty much everybody needs to go and pick one. Because this was, this is quite impressive. For, we had the, the brake flip, we had the crank bow, but we didn't really have anything that fit like, I am a primary, I am going to shoot darts fast and far. And that's exactly what the Crank Force is. It fires relatively fast, not as fast as a Rapid Madness, but you're going to be hitting better ranges than the Rapid Madness. And on top of that, it's just, it's got single fire, which is admittedly really goofy. I don't think you'd ever use this thing for single fire. And... and yeah, that doesn't work so well, but... The rapid fire works pretty darn good. Let's put that on there. And. Uh, it's a little hard to keep accuracy in question, but if you're really worried about that, you do have the single fire. So, wow, I was not expecting to like this as much as I did. I didn't even know it existed until today, but this is a solid, solid blaster. I am going to highly recommend, if you're looking to pick something up in Boomco, give this a shot. For 20 bucks, you get a hell of a lot. This was $20 on Amazon, I might mention, so pretty much anybody can get it. And doesn't look too bad to boot. Honestly, I'm, I'm quite, quite impressed, because I just spent $20 on that dual strike from Nerf, and I didn't get nearly as much as I got with this. Hmm. Well... Shock up another win for Boomco, because this is a very, very nice blaster. I hope to have more fun with it in the future, and if I have any problems with it, I'll let you know. Any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them in the comment boxes below, and until next time, I'll see you then.